I am 15 and 0 right now in the current global tournament with you guessed it, our favorite Expo Mortar cycle deck. Well, okay, it's not really a cycle deck. Now, this is a deck that does insanely well in this current meta, barring that one Earthquake deck, and it's also such a fun, fun deck to play. So without further ado, let's jump right into it. Starting off this match, both uh, me and my opponent going in with Royal Ghost. Now, this doesn't tell me too much. Okay, that will be a nice fireball for me. Uh, I'm just going to go ahead and mortar. Mortar! Okay, for some reason that mortar was taking a long time to get placed down. Um, but fortunately, we did get that mortar down. And uh, yeah, definitely bridge band matchup going to be a relatively good one. Ooh, and my opponent got a P.E.K.K.A. Okay, well, now that's definitely my cue to go in the opposite lane here. Of course, I'll go in with my Royal Ghost, like so. Oh, and he uses his zap. Okay, we're definitely we're gonna take that damage on the left lane here, and then we're just gonna go in with our skeleton army here. Um, and and I mean, just look at that. We absolutely just destroyed that Pekka, and we got you know over 1,500 damage on it to the opponent's arena tower, and we also got a bowler here. Um, he might try to you know cheese me with the magic archer, but uh, I'm actually just gonna straight up go in with a mortar. Um, just immediately going on offense again. Pekka's out of cycle, and we get another Mortar Lock just like that, dude. Oh my goodness. Alright, let's go in with our Inferno Dragon here. Um, note the placement. It's placed to the side. Um, in case... Okay, well, not anymore, but... But the reason I place it to the side is if the opponent has an E-Wiz, it might retarget the Inferno Dragon onto it, and then I can just fireball the E-Wiz out of the way. Um, it's not that... It didn't come into play here, but, uh, the opponent's Pekka is now out of cycle. So now we're going to go in with our Expo. He has no tank for the Expo. And oh man. Oh my goodness. Okay, so Bowler coming down here. And just look at this, dude. Just look at this. We're going to native everything together. Bowler is going to destroy absolutely everything. An another Expo lock onto the tower. I'm telling you, man, this deck is absolutely insane. And just like that, we're going to be getting ourselves a nice and easy win. Alright, so in this match, my opponent... Oh, I was just about to say my opponent isn't really making a move. Um, but I guess he goes with a Ram Rider. So, and he did actually cycle his Snowball. So I feel pretty safe going in with just a simple Skeleton Army like so. He's probably running Mega Knight. Um, so I, that sounds like his best counter. Um, but no, he goes in with a Bandit. So we're going to try and actually punish this. Um, with a nice little sneaky, sneaky, sneaky push in the opposite lane here. Um, let's fireball this out of the way. Of course, the mortar is going to get distracted on the Barbarian, but uh, let's actually just go in with our Inferno Dragon as well. He doesn't have Elixir to go in with like a Mega Knight or something like that. Um, and he actually spends Elixir with a Snowball as well. So we're actually just, you know, we're, we're going in even more here with our Royal Ghost. And uh, okay, it's not, it's not going to get that much damage. But as you can see, the opponent did have to spend a ton of Elixir defending. And I feel pretty confident in saying I can go in with an Expo here and the opponent won't be able to Mega Knight onto it and that is the case um so let's go in with our Skarmy here hopefully he doesn't predict a snowball okay he doesn't and that will be a nice little Expo lock here for us of course we're gonna fireball out the E-Wiz um make sure the Expo gets as much damage as possible skeleton army on the right side oh my goodness it's doing so much damage and uh, just like that let's get a mortar down on the field as soon as that expo dies dude a uh, mortar probably won't get a hit unfortunately but uh yeah as you can see looking very very good going into uh double elixir time so of course we're gonna go ahead and inferno dragon here bowler is gonna take care of the ram rider and he's gonna try to snowball really no use the ram rider probably might oh wow it actually does get a hit um, a little surprising there um but yeah okay the opponent is actually running pekka i did not expect that i was thinking mega knight this whole time um okay so what we're gonna do here is just go in with our skeleton army of course he's got uh he's got all all his all his good stuff uh to distract but that's fine um, what we're actually going to do here is use a center plant mortar, uh, which will pull the Ram Rider um, nice and easy. Ooh, oh no, the, okay, the E-Wiz actually doesn't hit um, the baby dragon. That's pretty good for me. Um, but uh, I think I'm actually going to have to fireball here, fireball this out of the way. All right, and uh, yeah, double elixir time. The, the P.E.K.K.A. player definitely has like a lot more stuff to play with. Um, but what we're going to do here is we're just going to cheese my opponent here, get a couple bowler hits onto the tower here. And uh, that is one sneaky trick, one sneaky, sneaky trick you can use 
um, is to, to, to get some locks there is with the bowler. <laughs> um, meanwhile, though, we will take this out of the way. He overcommits. That is such a huge overcommitment. And it looks like we're actually going to have to hold out this whole entire match, which is kind of annoying. But, uh, I mean, what can you do? Um, the opponent's really trying, you know. <laughs> um, but, uh, yeah, we're just going to go ahead and defend the rest of this match. We're looking pretty good here. And with 10 seconds left, he ain't taking our tower. I know that for sure. Um, so, yeah, let's go like this. Let's just kind of plop everything here. And, uh, yeah, going to be a nice and comfortable overtime victory for me. All right, so starting this one, my opponent here with an Archer Queen. Um, of course, that doesn't narrow the matchup down too much. Um, but let's see here. Of course, world goes up high. We want to get that initial hit there for us. Nice, nice, nice. And we're going to go in with our Mortar at like so. Um, two tank for everything. Oh, no, and the opponent. OK, he's going to get a connection there, um, but we can go ahead and use that to get a King Tower activation. So this is uh, this is the Mega Knight Bridge Bam deck here. Um, I know this deck. I'm going to say it doesn't have a zap. So we're going to go Skarmy here and risk it. OK, we that absolutely did not pay off. Um, we're just going to tank that and just go for the kill with the expo, I guess. Um, not much of a choice there. Um, all right. So, I mean, I guess we do get a slight expo connection, but I mean, not that much. So, all right, let's just mortar here. I, I, unfortunately, I don't think he has too many. Yeah, he doesn't have too many um, heavy counters. I might actually just ignore this Ram Rider. Um, I'm curious how much damage that'll do because I just I do have an activated King's Tower and I can afford to take a good amount of damage here. Uh, of course, the opponent does have lightning, so that is something that we do have to be careful for. Um, and as I say that, I give him a good amount of lightning value, which is not ideal. Um, let's see. Uh, of course, this will be a fireball for me. All right, let's go. And let's just go with a roll ghost here up high. Um, the Archer Queen should go down, so let's go in actually with our mortar. All right. And what I'm going to do here is just go in like so with our bowler. Um, unfortunately, the Inferno Dragon is going to lock onto the mortar. But we now go in with our own Inferno Dragon. He might lightning here. Um, he... What? Okay. Um, oh, that's not good. That's... I screwed up. I messed up. I messed up. Um, okay. All right. All right. Luckily, I think we're fine. I think we're fine. Um, okay, let's fireball this. Fireball this out of the way. All right, we're good. We're good. That banner better not dash. Of course. Okay. All right. Anyways, um, I think we go for the kill here. I think we go for the kill. I think that's the move. Um, let's do this. Uh, we just gotta make sure that. Oh no! I. Oh, that's not good. That's not. Good. Uh, let's roll goes here. I guess. Uh, we are in trouble here. We are in trouble. Um. Okay. Hopefully that Mega Knight doesn't take tower here. Um, that Mega Knight better not take tower. Um, okay, we're all right, we're all right. Um, oof, 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 this is rough, this is rough. Okay, let's go Skarmy in the back, and then let's Expo up top. All right, this is the move, this is the move. Um, okay, all right, we're fine. Okay, of course we fireball this, we fireball this. Expo locks, oh, come on. All right. Oh my God. And he gets a bandit lock too. Okay. All right. We need uh, we need to take tower here um, or else we're just absolutely dead. Um, so, okay. Mortar locks. Okay. Mortar does lock, please. Okay. Mortar. Okay. Mortar gets a hit. We just got to cycle to our fireball and oh my God, dude, that was way closer than it should have been, but we get the win nonetheless. Oh, and the opponent. Oh no. This is the hog earthquake matchup. Oh my goodness, dude. Of course, we're gonna have to face the Hog Earthquake matchup at some point, right? Alright, so we definitely got our work cut out for us here. Unfortunately, I don't have Expo in Cycle, otherwise I would 100% go in with the Expo. Um, but yeah, let's just slow roll it here, Bowler in the back. And uh, yeah, just play it, play it nice and chill. Of course, we have a good amount of counters to his Royal Hogs, but yeah, we just gotta make sure not give the opponent's Archer Queen too much value. Um, and... Uh, yeah, we should be doing fine here. Um, so, let's see here, I guess just Inferno Dragon. Like so. Archer Queen's ability is not in cycle, so we're just gonna go in with our Mortar here, like so. Okay. Alright. Alright, very nice. This is exactly what I wanted. And now we go in with the Expo. 
And now we go in with the expo. Okay, okay, okay. Big moves, big moves, big moves. All right, let's go in with our Skarmy here. He, I doubt he has Elixir for a log. Oh, he has Elixir for a log. Oh my God. All right, let's match up. I mean, it's pretty much over, but I guess I still have to try. So we're gonna fireball the left lane because we got the bowler in the right. Worried about that. Okay. Do this. Cycle to our skeleton army. Oh, we got we got destroyed so hard. He's so yeah, he's activating the ability. Alright. Alright, man. Ah, oh, We got we are so screwed. We are so screwed, dude. Oh my god. Oh my goodness. Alright, let's go in with our Inferno Dragon, I guess, for the cannon. Um, nothing much else. Really do. Um. Ah, yeah, yeah. I guess we'll go Skarmy here. Um. And then I guess we'll bowler in the back. Okay. All right. That's what we'll do. All right. Let's go mortar here. We got a tank for for things somehow. <laughs> um. Okay. All right. That's an Inferno Dragon. All right. I'll take that. I'll take that. All right, now we go Expo. We go Expo now. We go Expo now. Okay. Okay, that's a... Oh, that, that's a lock. That's a lock. I'll take it. I will take it. I'll take it. Um... Okay. Do this. Okay. I should have needed that back. I should not have done that. Um, okay. Okay. You just gotta go in. We gotta cheese the opponent. Whole, whole objective. Cheese my opponent. All we have to do, that is all we have to do here, is cheese my opponent, and we'll be doing great. Uh, let's go ahead, I, I guess, NATO here. Ooh, please, Expo, Expo locks on, Expo locks on, okay, 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 we have to cycle back, we have to cycle back, uh, okay, um, we just have to get our, uh, <laughs> we just have to get back to our fireball, come on, please, I'm begging you, I am begging you, please, game, please, game, give, give me this, give me this one, come on, come on, please, okay, <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god, dude. This this matchup is always the worst, dude. I I think that's enough clash for for one day.